While the city of Denver waits for the sun to melt the snow on the roads, that's the strategy, it's giving warnings to homeowners and businesses who have not shoveled off sidewalks. Usually only a few of those notices turn into fines, and that's what we're seeing with this latest storm. So here's how it works. Property owners have 24 hours after a storm to shovel. The city relies on complaints to 311 to go out and do spot enforcement. We talked to one man who had no problem letting the city know who's breaking the rules in his West Colfax neighborhood. If we encounter properties that, you know, it's been 24, maybe 48 hours, haven't shoveled, um, hard to get the stroller through, we'll uh, pull up the PocketGov app and send in a notice to 311 saying the, the property's not been shoveled. Boom, knock them out just like that. In the first five days of 2023, the city says it inspected 755 complaints and 180 of the cases they found the sidewalk was already clear by the time they got there. So they issued 567 notices to people saying shovel or pay $150. And the notices work. There were only eight instances where people refused and they had to give out tickets. It's interesting, people talk about what would the cost be of additional snow removal in one form or another. Whatever they're spending to send inspectors around to put notices on doors mm. seems to make a lot of sense because if, if they give out 500 plus and only eight people refuse, that's a pretty good rate. Say that again. That's pretty, I don't know, that's a pretty good rate.